my main screen, baby. Don't you, you wanna get between my baby? Young, successful, and sexy. Foxy Brown and Lil' Kim are two newcomers on the hip-hop scene. They sing about designer clothes, cars, and sex. But some say they're X-rated. Lil' Kim makes no apologies. People can sit back and listen to my album and say, Wow, I thought I was the only one who did that. But it's just that I'm bold enough to say it. And I'm bold enough to do it. Then I'm the same chick that you want to get with. And make me wear it hot. Lil' Kim's sexy bad girl image can be seen in her 1997 calendar. Her style is a far cry from other female rappers who've been successful in the industry. I rock the party that rocks the body. MC Light and DeBrat have made it in the male-dominated world of rap, but their style is similar to their male counterparts. Lil' Kim says just because she's got a racy image doesn't mean her rhymes aren't as good. People expect it as that, dad, you know, she's sexy and everything, but her lyrics is actually tight. People actually love my songs. I mean, even women. Even women. And mostly women. What is all this sex? What is all that? Hot 97 personality Wendy Williams has a lot to say when it comes to Lil' Kim. She often speaks to kids about the hip-hop world, like here at Hubbard Middle School in Plainfield, New Jersey. Negative influences on kids, especially young girls, concern Williams. The DJ tells students the industry is not always as prosperous as it seems. There is a pecking order and a big price to pay for getting down the way some of these females are getting down. A big price. You're not seeing your loop? Check it out. These young aspiring female rappers say kids have to have their own minds and not be influenced by music. Well, it is a bad influence, but the people who would like to lead themselves, it's not a bad influence because they don't have to really take it and listen to it. Williams told these kids that it takes more than just designer clothes and sex to stay in the business for a long time. After your breasts fall, what are you going to do then? You can't be a trick all of your life. I'm the big kahuna. I got the whole thing. Salt and Pepper are one female group who've managed to have longevity. For 13 years, they've been pumping out hits. Group member Spinderella has done an album on her own and has just opened this full-service salon called She Things in Queens. And we all know we've got to come through here at least once a week. <sighs> this is for you. This is another side of me that, you know, that I have a brain. Business is business, you know what I'm saying? So you can be sexy and beautiful and be strong and have a business sense. <laughs> One up-and-coming female rapper who's trying to combine sexiness with respect is Mother Superior. Maybe if you put your standards a little bit higher and have more self-respect, then it will make less black men be in jail. It will have less black men being disrespectful. I think the burden of the black community falls on the black women. And that's just my personal opinion. Because if you have a bunch of women that act like whores, you're going to have a bunch of men who act like whoremongers. Lil' Kim says she mostly gets positive feedback about what she does, but knows there will always be critics. It's not for attention. This is what helped me. This is where I've been, and this is what I know. So this is what I've talked about. Laverne Atkinson, UPN 9 News.